Stephanie Price is here, the Panhandle Plains Historical Museum. Their annual open house at Christmas is yeah. killer. Killer, oh, killer. I mean, if you're, if you're gonna go and do something, that's the one to do. I right. encourage everyone, if you want to feel good about your organization, just come talk to Allie. <laughs> Man, she is always so encouraging. And You're so nice. We're so excited to celebrate Christmas at the museum on Saturday. It's going to be so much fun. So thank you for having me on, guys. Of course. So I want to talk about um, the music. I really love when you all have live music there and lots and lots of kids. I mean, this is a kind of a busy open house, Sheldon, if you've ever been. Yep. And then you're saying, hey, we're putting a donation uh, to it also. Yeah, this is our community give back. So we do pay, tell people they can come in for free. Um, we would love it if you would bring a canned food item or a dollar for the High Plains Food Bank. Even better is a dollar. You know, Tina Berlin, I'm sure I'll tell you in a minute when she comes on the show, but the food bank can stretch your dollars so, so far to feed yeah. our neighbors in need. So as the museum, we get, um, you know, we are a nonprofit and we, we get, um, you know, such wonderful donors and people who support us all year long. So it's our way to give back to our community and do this free event where, like you said, there's quite just filling the the air with Christmas music. We've got cookie decorating. Santa and Mrs. Claus are Aww, there good. to take the kiddos. Um, such a fun way to to get your Santa pictures done because it's free. It's a little less chaos than maybe other places. And so we really love being able to put on this event. I love that you said that, um, Sheldon. You when you go through the museum, one of my favorite part. You, you have parts about Borger and other things in the Panhandle. There's super beautiful cars. I mean, there's so many settings yes. that, uh, that people can see. I think it's like no other museum. And we're all decorated for Christmas. We have a 20 something foot Christmas tree that is in Pioneer oh. Hall. So come take your Christmas card photos, you know, come be, come be a part of what we're doing on Saturday. It is just a really fun, fun day. And like you said, you, you get to see the museum for free and that doesn't happen very often so you can tour around these awesome exhibits that you're seeing on your screen right now and you know come and learn about the history but also have a really fun Christmas time as well. So what time do people need to know to come out for this open house to sure. get there for free? It is all day. It is 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Okay. So we'll have choirs every 30 minutes. We're gonna have storytelling with the Canyon Area Library. They're gonna come read some stories to kiddos. Cookie decorating all day. Santa will be available and um, just a really great time and a take home craft. I mean, we well, are we making go. wreaths with kids' handprints. Oh. You were talking to me about your kiddos. Cute. That'd be such a fun keepsake yes. for you to have. I know I'm going to have, have my girls come do I, one, Well, I so. wanted to ask you, uh, listen, you have two little girls. I do. Have they have they got to go to this event yet? So uh, Gemma was just born this summer, so this is her first Christmas. So oh. we'll take her out there because I happen to be close personal friends with the with our Santa. Gotcha. So gotcha. we will come and do some photos with Santa on fun. Saturday. So it'll be well, really fun. Kids really like it, but I know in school usually you get to take a trip to the hop, to the uh, Panhandle Plains Historical Museum. Sheldon, did y'all ever get to go into Mexico? Did you ever get to we, go? We never came all the way to Canyon. We, we had the Blackwater Drive Museum in Portales, oh. but I know in college, you know, like I said, you let the WT students come in, check out the museum we for do. free, and we came a lot, and it's just, a, it's always a good time in there. You like to the Pioneer Town. I mean, I'm personally partial to the cars. I think they're pretty great, but like I said, the I fact that all that's going to have a Christmas twist is certainly going to make it really, really fun. That's awesome. Yep. Should we hope you come out. So I love that you, you came during college. Yeah. That's yes. one thing we love to offer as a perk is free for WT students. Definitely That's a lot neat. of fun. And right now, are you still talking about the buffalo? Yes, we do have the um, the American Icon exhibit. The bison exhibit is open. So, And we also have the Art of State Parks. So oh. that is um, art from all over the state of Texas about our state parks because it is still their 100th anniversary till the end of the year. Oh, good. So lots to do this weekend. So okay. Saturday, I hope you'll come out to the museum. And then that night is Christmas in Canyon. So it is part of Christmas in Canyon. You can come to the museum and then you can go down to the square for the tree lighting and their electric light parade as well. That's fun. So, That's so lots fun. to do in Canyon on Saturday. I know. Listen, yep. Canyon's the place. I love that. I'm so glad you came. Thanks, guys. Uh, we, we hadn't got to see you. I know. It's been a minute. Good, good to see you. Well, Tina Brolin's.